Hello everyone and welcome back to Extreme Gaming Fever. Now before we proceed in this video, in this unboxing video, I really want to say that I'm not a professional tech YouTuber, so I don't do the unboxing videos, stuff like that. So um, yeah, that was my desk and the light was not enough. So you may see some noise in the video and some low light situation here. So I'm I'm sorry for that because this, this is what, what I could <laughs> you know do so first thing first today's unboxing is iPad Pro 2020 11 inches so here it is and uh, now we are simply first of all uh, going to unbox this iPad Pro and uh, then uh, we will move to the other things as well okay so here we go now uh, I have to check uh, the seal is already broken because I have to check that it's not damaged during the courier okay so, and I didn't you know uh, open it up or set it up so it's intact I just checked if it's not broken if it's broken or not because it was delivered to me from quite a long uh, it, it this iPad traveled a lot of distance and uh, okay so next thing in this box is basically you know the uh, papers and other stuff uh, which I can show you because uh, some people uh, some people later uh, say that why you didn't show us what came in that thing so that's why toward this thing I'm just going to show you I do want to mention that I did get two Apple stickers but uh, for some reason uh, they were stuck inside this box so I couldn't pull them off pull them out and uh, yeah this is basically what it is in these uh, some documents etc and uh, thankfully we get a charger which apple not including with the new iphones this year and a type c uh, cable which, which uh, you can use to connect to your uh, pc mac or to, your, to charge your ipad that's it that's all for the uh, for the uh, ipad unboxing now we will simply uh, remove this uh, plastic sheet from this iPad and uh, this is the first time I'm going to uh, peel this sheet off from this iPad wow very I'm very excited about this iPad so yeah let me check and here you can see it's uh, in mint condition very clean and neat and clean of course uh, it's uh, it's gonna look like that because it's uh, brand new okay now first time let's put this thing up this is my first ever Apple device and uh, I'm so excited uh, for this I iPad uh, now I will explain why I choose the iPad and why I choose to go with the iOS instead of a uh, string on Android so I will explain that in, uh, in later or in another video so yeah, we'll set this later. Now let's move on to our Apple Pencil. Yeah, how can you uh, have an iPad without Apple Pencil? Because Apple Pencil is, I think, a must-have accessory for the iPad. So this is the second generation uh, Apple Pencil, uh, which is compatible with the iPad Pro. So I, I bought this uh, with the iPad as well. And uh, you, now let's simply uh, unbox this. So I didn't check this, uh, break the seal of this uh, pencil because I knew it's just a pencil. <laughs> uh, because iPad was uh, delivered from another city and this I got from the shop itself. So designed by Apple in California and uh, now I don't think uh, we get any kind of stickers with the Apple pencil. This is just uh, some documents probably the guides on how to use uh, this apple pencil which is which is not so hard, hard so here you can see the apple pencil logo and the tip of this apple pencil uh, now let's simply uh, remove this uh, protecting sheet from this pencil wow so i really want to see if it rolls on the desk or not so <laughs> i don't know why but i really want to see that okay so um, the last but not the least is the brand new controller since my old controller was a cheap Chinese controller so I had to get the uh, brand new controller so I decided to go with the uh, Microsoft Xbox controller because I can use this controller on my PC as well I don't know if you can use the uh, PlayStation controller on your PC or not but I, I was sure that I would be able to use this controller on my PC as well so yeah 
I simply went for this one. Moreover, I was getting this cheaper compared to the DualShock uh, PlayStation 4 controller. Oops, I <laughs> that was the worst unboxing ever. So I literally opened the uh, box wrong. Okay, so we do get some uh, documents from this box as well. Uh, probably as usual the guides or on how to connect this controller uh, with your different devices probably uh, I, I don't think they are gonna mention how you can connect this uh, to mobile devices as well so yeah I have already watched a tutorial on YouTube on that and uh, nothing else in this box basically so we do get two double A batteries with this uh, controller which is good since uh, you know <laughs> I was not I was not expecting the battery inside this wow this feels so so much ergonomic and uh, so much uh, comfortable to hold so you can see the look of this controller uh, I really want to say that it doesn't feel that premium it looks like it's made out of a very cheap and third class plastic but you know I I don't know maybe the, these are like that but you know at least my Chinese controller was has better build quality than this Xbox uh, 1S controller. Uh, by the way, uh, the thing is uh, the buttons which are in this uh, controller that Chinese that may have some good quality plastic used to build that controller but the button response was terrible on that controller. So I hope that I will get some better uh, gameplay experience on this controller. So yeah, let's simply uh, put these cells on. I'm just really careful here. I don't want to create a mess here. So I will carefully put that lid back on this. And uh, now let's finally start this. Ooh, that was really quick compared to my old Chinese one. Okay, so we are now going to connect this. Okay, so uh, I just connected this controller with my iPad. And uh, yep. Let's go and test this controller in the game. So this whole setup was, uh, you you can say that I spent, or uh, maybe some people would say I wasted that much money for Farming Simulator 20, uh, but that's not true. Yeah, Farming Simulator 20 was priority, but uh, not that much. Uh, I did need, uh, probably I was, uh, uh, I need I I need iPad for other things as well. I had to manage my uh, channel since I have two channels now. One is in English, this one, and one in another language, uh, the gaming side, which is my second channel, and uh, that channel of uh, feature content in Hindi languages as well, Hindi and Urdu. I'm from Pakistan, so I made that channel for my people uh, they speak urdu so i make videos on that channel in urdu okay so um you can see uh, this ipad offers 120 hertz refresh rate it's a very responsive screen on any ipad and it's a very powerful device compared with a very responsive controller i guess this is the best possible farming simulator 20 experience i ever had in my life now I'm, I'm not sure about the Nintendo Switch but I think this is better than Nintendo Switch because uh, you have a bigger screen if you are not comparing it uh, that you can connect to your, the, your Nintendo Switch your TV, to your TV. Uh, you can also pair, uh, connect your uh, iPad to your TV as well but overall I think uh, it's a very good experience if you don't consider con uh, connecting your device to a TV. Um, the iPad and this Xbox One S controller both these things so goes very well together and at the end you get a very nice experience of farming simulator 20 so i'm definitely gonna get uh, my apple arcade subscription and i will enjoy some other games as well and i will be also uh, creating some drawings as well since i got this apple pencil uh, which is very nice i have already used this a little bit so yeah that was the unboxing video. I hope that you will enjoy this video and if you do so then please make sure you leave a like. I will see you in my next video very soon. Bye.